What's up guys? Welcome back to Half Men Half Tech. My name is Ben, your host. So finally, when it comes to iOS 15, we now have iOS 15.3. For me on my iPhone that you're seeing here, this update actually comes in at exactly 4.56 gigs. And I was updating from iOS 15.3 betas so in a sense this sort of re-downloads the os that's why you see a big update size or update file and for now let's just update our device and we'll be able to see what are the new features or new changes that came with this software update my device has already been updated here and if we go into settings and then go to general and go to software update you can see it says it's up to date ios 15.3 and if we go to about uh, this iphone section you can see the build number that we have here it's 19 d 49 so that has been updated from the previous beta that we came from and if you see the modern firmware version it's 5.01.01 so nothing has changed for me for my device coming from the previous beta that i was on so in terms of new features and new changes that have been addressed with this update the first one has to do with the wallet app and it seems like this ios 15.3 contains or at least references some code that you you soon be able to add an apple digital id to your wallet app and so far it seems to reference the united states that's how it usually happen and then it branches out so that is something that is referenced but not fully supported in this update the second thing that has been updated with this update has to do with child uh, protection so to be specific we're talking about communication safety in messages that is basically a tool that will be able to help parents or guardians or those that man devices to be able to get notified when a minor receives a photo that may contain nudity this is not csm where apple is continuously scanning your pictures it's just communication safety messages and it's meant to protect minors or children and so with this update there's basically been minor wording changes and you can see that it's supported from ipad os and ios 15.2 and later so this ios 15.3 is supported and just minor wording changes complicated terms have been simplified with this update so nothing much and also if you listen to a lot of podcasts or read some news articles and you are not being able to see your favorite or your following articles show up when you go to follow then with this update that issue has been really uh, has been resolved rather so that is something that's good and also with podcast there have been some minor wording changes the experience won't change you won't see like new uh expressions or new mo motions it's just like wording change that has to do with the back of the os so that is something that's great now when it comes to the memory usage bug with ios 15.2 and the first part of 15.3 there were some people that were actually complaining that when it comes to iphone storage their devices were actually taking up more space than they actually do so you would have like a brand new device and you put it on a beta and it shows that you are almost like using 256 gigs of 256 six gigs which was like impossible so with this update that issue seems to be resolved for the iphone 13 pro and also for the iphone x so far no one has mentioned that they are experiencing this issue on ios 15.3 so that is something that's great and all as always like they mentioned in the notes of this release of ios 15.3 they just mentioned that this is basically recommended for all users because it has some security updates and if we go to the ios 15.3 release notes you can see that there isn't much that they mentioned it just mentions that there's no new release notes for this software update so you can see that it's not much it's actually a big file 4.56 gigs on my iphone and not much has changed no new settings menus or new wallpapers or even new screen savers so for now it seems like you know this is what we have when it comes to ios 15.3 let me know what else i might have missed and what issues you are 
experiencing and i'll be able to test it out together with you other than that guys that's about it for me stay safe and as always don't forget to subscribe and i'll definitely see you in the next video